win a match. So that's what they have to do right here. And if they were able to close out the rest of their two group games with wins, they would theoretically make it out. But don't, don't quote me on that because I'm not entirely sure. I'd have to see the entire permutations. But the most important thing, they get a win on the board right here because if they lose, they're out of the group. Yeah, absolutely. They need three points in this one. Obviously, depends on what happens with the other match between the other two sides. But we have uh, Broken Silence, of course, playing as Arsenal, right to left. And um, we've got FC Nantes, actually, for this one. Aliga Sul are playing left to right. And Killer Bali is a player to watch out for. He is a mountain of a man. Very tall. And obviously, use the width well. You're going to create chances and possibly create self a nice little goal. It's an early chance here for Broken Silence. That's what they need to do. Get the ball in early. Flicked on. But a comfortable save, Harry, by the goalie. Yeah, Alex Aguathil has started very brightly. He's one I'm going to watch out for. The, the Spaniard flanked by the two Italians on Broken Silence. He is as the... The pink cursor in this match on, on the Arsenal side, so look out for him. He's been very bright early on. Granted, we've only done five minutes of the game so far. Certainly have, and that was a good-looking ball towards the back post. Delivered in, there it is! The opening goal, first blood for FC Nantes and the Brazilians. And, well, they just they swung it in, Harry. They looked for the back post. It wasn't there, but you keep it low. It's a excited Koulibaly. With the finish, right place, right time, and a great move. Just moving past the defender there. Koscielny really needs to be a little bit more active. Not sure who it was who was controlling him on the broken silence side, but wow, nightmare start. And really credit to the Liga Sol Stars. They are stars for a reason. And now we'll have to see, can broken silence bounce back? Yeah, they're going to try and work it forward. They need an instant reply. The ball is delivered in. There it is. The instant reply in full effect and broken silence, not only their equalizing goal, but the first goal of the tournament. We didn't see enough, Harry, in the first game. They didn't use the wings. They kept going central and it didn't happen. They've switched it up here. They've delivered it in. They've got their opening goal. Certainly identified what went wrong in that first game against the Japanese outfit and maybe the South American style, the South American play style, the way they defend might be playing in their favor a little bit more it's a, a well-worked goal as you said moving out wide a little bit more and it's Alex Alguathil the pass to the assist there I think it was Eterito actually yeah swinging it in for Ildistura Ildistura I can never pronounce his name so I never say it's it it's a but mouthful it was the Italian the other Italian the other on the Italian lineup to head it home and a great response the perfect response yeah great that's what we want to see goals early 12 minutes gone one apiece here in a, in a real nail-biter of a clash, because if Aligasol wins this, pretty much guarantees them uh, into the semi-finals, of course. And uh, if Broken Silence don't get the three points, they're going to be probably heading out. But we have a, a little bit more action again. FC Nantes working it through. It's a bit of a risky clearance, but cleared away. Obviously, we've got two world champions on stage here, Gafiera and Etorito. Both been there before, done it. But it is a different style of play, isn't it, Harry, when you are playing co-op and not that 1v1? Yeah, certainly. Room for more creativity, more passes to look out for, certainly more runs on the go. So you have to have your brain switched on. And you mentioned a, a world champion. In fact, I'll come back to that as it looks like Broken Silence here trying to mount an attack of their own. Yeah, well, it plays it on. Lovely little fake Mikatari and the Armenian trying to find half a yard, but good piece of defending. And if you've played Pez, you would know defending is not the easiest thing to do in the world. So give them full credit when you are capable of stopping the likes of uh, Eterito and Gafiera. Uh, as they come forward, here is Colo. Watch out for the big man of Kulabali. The ball is delivered and it is flicked in towards him. And that is Ooh. off the line. I thought it may have crept <laughs> in, but good hands by Pedacek. So close, right on the line. The point I was going to make earlier on, yes, you have two world champions, one on each side, but also a chance for revenge for Alimau, losing to Retorito in the final of the WESG tournament in China. Certainly a chance at revenge. He would love to knock out the reigning world champion here in this group stage game. What a yeah. scalp that would be. Yeah, of course, you were there, weren't you, for the uh, for those? Indeed I was, and Alamal was bested by the, the Italian world champion, Eterito, in the final, but had glimpses where he showed promise. Oh, it's a nice move here. Can he get it under? Great little fake. Tried to lay it square. Good defensive covering there. And now broken silence. It's got to maintain a bit of possession because we've seen them play at their absolute best, and when they do, they are a very, very difficult side to stop. But maybe that first game, you know, they obviously did lose, and 
they spoke a lot about it afterwards and discussed the problems and the issues and they've got to try and rectify here but they're up against really really tough opponents as the ball is swung out to the uh, other flank can he keep it alive yes he can lays it inside there is months back towards him decides to lay it in once again looking to just open up a chance colo fed it through beautifully and there is number two for the brazilians now that was a very patient build-up play i have been so so impressed by a league of soul stars so far the brazilians bringing in that samba play style so so patient and they are so disciplined here in the first half the way they aren't snatching at half opportunities like we've seen from games previous here at the world finals we'll see it here uh, it could shoot right there but Good instead just point. plays it through to Koulibaly who has the almost guaranteed goal at that point and well the finish was was perfect too so even if Czech was on the right side of it which he in the end was not I don't think he would have saved it so a great goal a really great passage of play to put them back into the lead yeah Koulibaly not only good in the air but also good at finishing as well so 2-1 broken silence what have they got in their arsenal again to try and come back from a goal down once more they've got about 12 minutes to play they've been thinking the ball over and there surely it is <laughs> something about the momentum in this game that just it carries from one team to the other and it's another instant reply this time Mkhitaryan Mkhitaryan and it was, it's Alex Alguathil who failed to qualify for the one versus one finals he'll be joining us in the studio tomorrow but he's the man to bury it and that is going to do so, so much to the psychology of this game. Psychologically, the league of all starts. They're going to be thinking any time that they score now, Broken Silence will reply. And it's a great finish. A great chipped ball into the box. Nice header down from Il Distruttore. I said it right that there time. There you go. Perfect. Heading it down to Mkhitaryan, controlled by Alex. Mm -hmm. So back to honors even back to evens absolutely and you can see there just drew Bamiang drew two defenders which did free up the space for Mikatarian. once again those are the little differences because if you don't communicate if you've got two players going to mark one player obviously you're going to free up a little bit too much room for the opposition and it has happened uh, here we've got 10 minutes to play and it has been a very lively game four goals in the opening half and here is a chance now for Maitland Niles lays it inside Mikatarian. this is better by broken silence Flicked on, laid across, took a little deflection. And if you're, uh, how do you play now if you're Harry, if you're broken silence, you're at 2-2. Have you been happy with this first half display? Uh, seems like right now they're, they're almost playing off Eterito as the midfield creator, creating for his two teammates. I almost want to see the world champion in those advanced positions. Watch out for the green marker, that's whenever yeah. Eterito is on the ball. You'll see him often in midfield, it's not often they're finding him in the in the advanced positions. I want to see him get up the pitch a little bit more, maybe look for his teammates to find him, and then he might just have a better chance at uh, putting some of these away. But honestly, so far, this first half has been fairly even. It has been, yeah. We've had chances at both ends. The goalies haven't made too many saves because they've been pretty prolific yep. in putting the ball in the back of the net. There's the possession, 52 for broken silence. So very, very even. One minute to play and probably not a whole lot of stoppage time either. Remember, this is an all-important game for broken silence they have to get some points on the board and here is a chance for Mkhitaryan lays it across Maitland Niles looking to play it square the volley took a slight deflection and that will be the end of a very entertaining first half Harry very entertaining and you can see the points leader of the entire game Alex Alguathil I pointed him out as someone potentially you might look for to bring the spark to broken silence led the the team and points as well as passes so certainly seems to be playing those quick one twos and then making runs off the ball I'm not sure what you were just now for broken silence the uh, draw for me not good enough you gotta win this game to give you a fighting chance you don't want to leave the results of the group elsewhere to decide your fate you want to keep it within your own hands and to do that you've got to get a win right here so they can't really sit back they can't keep playing the way they're playing at the moment they gotta be a little bit more aggressive yeah, a draw is, is purely not going to be good enough, I don't feel. Uh, just having the one point on the board, even if they win the last game, um, I still don't think it's enough. Either way, it's kind of premature at this point because we still have 45 minutes left as we hope to get the second half underway.
Of course, leave your thoughts on Twitter as well. Hashtag Pez League. Who do you think is going to win this one? 45 minutes left. Uh, of course, they've switched sides now. Broken silence left to right as they look to attack down the left-hand side. Danny Welbeck dispossessed. And uh, Aligasu are attacking from right to left, playing as the only FC nonce in this competition for the co-op. That's a great ball. Mikatarian near post. Well played, Traore. Good bit of pressure here by the current champions looking to uh, retain their title. Good bit of defensive covering there from Alamal. He's recognizing the danger, was able to clear it, but Broken Silence, they've started this half very, very well. And something they were trying to do right there is something that I asked of them as the time ticks down for them to take this throw in, was to try and get Eterito, the green marker, up, up the pitch a little bit more, get him in those advanced areas. Don't make him be the playmaker. Continue trying to run those one-twos with Alex Aguathiel and try and get the world champion into those clinical positions. Definitely, and now a chance down the other end of the field. Oh, that's oh. a little bit of a waste there. Sometimes you, you make the odd wrong decision. It's going to head back to Broken Silence as they're looking to take the lead. Remember, for the first time in this game, they've come from behind twice. After being a goal down, they got straight back in it, did exactly the same thing again. Headed by Bamiang, nicely worked to Mkhitaryan. Maitland Niles to his left, decides to go to the right-hand side to Hector Bellerin. Lovely ball to Obama Yang, but he's generally a player, as I said in the last game, you want in the box because of his height advantage. He's fed it across, dispossessed by Traore. And I feel like this could be a bit of a cagey start to the second half. It may open up, though, as players start to wear down and get a little bit tired as we cross the 65, 70-minute mark. Here's Mons. Back towards him, and that has drifted yep. out of play. I mean, Harry, at this point, it's 2-2. If you're at Liga Sil, you have four points technically now on the board if it stays the same. Would you be happy with that? Certainly better than a loss. I mean, you yeah. don't want Broken Silence catching up to you when you consider them the, the main competition in the group, so to speak. But, I mean, both teams are world championship caliber. Both teams, both sets of players want to be at the highest level, and they want to get wins wherever they can. And... I feel like both sets of players there on the stage feel like there are points to be gained from this game. The one thing I'm worried about, though, from Broken, broken Silence that we saw just before this pause came in, they are starting to play a little bit more aggressive with their fullbacks, and that's leaving them quite exposed at the back. I think the League of Soul Stars have started to exploit that a little bit, and I just want to make sure that Broken Silence don't throw the baby out with the bathwater. They... Yes, they have to push for the win, but at the same time, they have to be sound defensively as well. That's right. Liga still are playing that 4-3-3, so Arsenal with uh, broken silence there, losing possession, can be vulnerable down the flanks. We've already seen the big man, Kalabali, is a threat when the ball is whipped in. As uh, There he is winning the header. Great That's cover good. there. Yeah, it was a good defensive play. And here comes Iwobi now. Lacazette to his left. Does find him. Gets it back again. Eterito just lays it across. But now here is a chance to bring it forward. And they have got numbers. If they can switch it, but they can't. Well played. Once again, the defending is good. You've got to make sure you can make the challenge and cover players. Otherwise, you're always going to leave yourself vulnerable. Iwobi, great ball. Play this first time. He does. Can he tap it in? No, he can't. That was a chance. Millimeters away. 25 minutes left. They're still looking broken silence for this all-important goal they don't want to concede though Waris not going to opt to shoot of course they do like to play very tick attacker style of play oh there was two players free there Harry and he was millimeters away yeah you saw them both Koulibaly was one of them he's already got two in this game and you can't let him get into positions there like this is. Koulibaly, that's what he does he is an absolute tank in the air and that may be all too much because they're going to need two now without reply. And he's taken home the match ball. What a goal. What a hat trick. The star man for the Brazilians. And look at broken silence. I hate to use the pun, but they look broken. They look like they are right now in silence. They how, do. how do they respond? They've gotten two goals quickly since the Liga Sol scored their own two and they're going to have to do it a third time once again Koulibaly just getting in those danger areas just moments before he was just on the edge of the six yard box ready to tap one in and here he is again cropping or popping up I should say in the same area and rising ahead of the defender and 
putting in the third. Yep, over seven foot tall when he jumps off the ground. I mean, there's no <laughs> way you're going to catch him. And that is the problem. When you don't close down on the flanks and you give him a little bit of time, you will concede. This is a, an immediate pause coming in from Broken Silence. I, I wouldn't be surprised to see them maybe push an extra player up the pitch right here, maybe go for some tactical changes. It's not been working for them so far. And I mean, yeah, they've, they've gotten two goals in, in quick succession after yeah. the opponent scored. But I think it's all starts. They're going to be wary to that now. They're going to know they're going to have to defend a little bit tighter off the restart, maybe not be a little bit too lax. Still, spirits are high, but their backs are against the wall. Don't forget, a draw probably not good enough. So they're going to need two goals in the next 20 or so in-game minutes. I can't remember off the top of my head how far ticked we are here in the second half. But, I mean, their backs are against the walls. The world champions right now, they are, well, they're truly under the cosh. Yeah, elsewhere, of course, beginners are facing Buttaram United. So if beginners win that... And the, the result stays the same here. Broken Silence are unfortunately going home in the, uh, in the group stage, which would be a huge upset. Massive. And they've got 20 minutes now to get something back. They've got to go for it, which is really going to open this game up as Johan is just taking this to the corner flag. Nicely worked, a little bit of a fake. Still going, beautiful feet, but he's run that out of play. And that is going to be a goal kick. I mean, Harry, what do you do in a situation like this if you're broken silence? Do you just go for it now? And if you concede, you concede. Yeah, I think they've pushed a couple of the midfielders a little bit more attacking. And you just have to hope again that you don't concede. A foul there comes in from Griffera. Um, just before, I think it was Ralph Montero actually skinning Eterito up the other end of the pitch. So they can't be lax defensively here. They have to make sure they maintain their concentration levels. Here's Mkhitaryan, got to get the ball in. Don't mess around with it. And Katia, I know they like to possess, but you've got to use what you have. Lovely ball flicked on. Aubameyang surely scores, but no. Somehow the goalie has plucked it away from him. And that could prove huge in this matchup. Well, that's why you've got to love all these events. So close, these matches. Well, here is the chance of Bamiang. If he's onside, he is. He's got options in the middle. Surely he's going to lay it square or he's going to go it alone. Oh, maybe the wrong option. He did have the square pass, Harry, but he decided against it. And it was Eterito, I think, with Alex Alguathil steaming through the middle. But I think Eterito there recognised Alex was covered. Maybe went for the surprise play at the near post. I don't think it was the right one. No, and now they need the most from this corner. If it works out, then it's worked a treat, but it hasn't. Bellerin flicked on. Aubameyang. Look how many players are there, though, Harry. Great it's defending, amazing. isn't it? Absolutely. Throw bodies in front of the ball, and that is the mission right now for the League of Souls stars. Yeah, they've played well. 3-2. They lead with eight minutes left. Traore, that'll do, they say. Just get it out. Yep. Defending numbers now and defend as much as possible. Don't do anything silly and give away, you know, a free kick or something on the edge of the box. Here is Nketiah, back towards Aubameyang. Nice little turn, flick towards him. That's a great goal. Oh, no. no! I thought it was in, somehow that stayed out. It's come back inside again. The pressure still mounts. Surely this time it's oh, come back again. Too many touches. And uh, finally the ball's away. Oh, my word. Too many touches that time from Alex Algothiel. Ball is still on, though. That's a great ball in. Oh, oh what a save. save that is. Breathtaking stop by the goalie. And that is the difference between possibly staying in the competition and going home. Look at this for a stop. It may have been hit in the bar, but he didn't know. I think it was, and... If it did, it might have bounced back into that danger area, but time ticking away. Ideally, they need a goal from this corner kick, else they may just be going home. Well, they've been unlucky. It's another chance. Good goalkeeping there, but he's off his line. Flicked away. Two minutes to play. El Nene, oh, he's dispossessed. Are they going to get it? They are. Waris now, surely just, yep, hit the corner. Anywhere will do. Final two minutes of stoppage time and another fantastic result by the Brazilians. Gaifera has, well, captained his side here to perfection and they are going to be advancing no matter what happens now into the semi-finals. And Harry, you have to say they fully deserve this. There's your full-time whistle. They've done it.
They've taken out their main rivals here in group play. The reigning champions, Broken Silence, broken.